Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ray Love and I'm back with another mukbang. I'm back with my sleepy son. And today, <laughs> you say hello? You sound like hello. Today we have Chinese food, y'all. I didn't feel like cooking, so I'm starving. Ugh. Yeah. Right, he had a long day today. Um, He's having chicken wings and fried rice, and I'm having shrimp and broccoli and half of one of his chicken wings that he didn't know that I took while I was setting up. <laughs> okay. Let's get a prayer so we can eat. Heavenly Father, I want to thank you for this food. Place before me. In Jesus' name always, amen. Amen. All right, y'all. Um, so hungry. You feel like you're starving? What did you eat today? I think this is my first meal too. This is my broccoli, y'all. Mmm. I did shrimp and broccoli from this place because this shrimp is always nice and clean. Oh, and mmm. I'm starving. You feel like you're hungry? I will devour him. <laughs> I got water, so I have water. Woo! Yeah, I had work this morning. And yesterday, I didn't get no sleep, right? Went to work and came home. I didn't take a nap or nothing. I still went to sleep, babe. Really? Yeah, I went to sleep like 12. And I woke up at 3. And if I knew if I went back to sleep, I wouldn't wake up on time. Mmm. No, I was like 4 30. I went to sleep at 4. I just haven't been sleeping. I just figure I'm just never gonna sleep, so that's life for me now. I just don't sleep. But I woke up at like 11. So, no, like 11.30, that's when you call me, right? Mm-hmm. And usually, I'm an early person. Like, I, wake, I like to wake up early. I usually be up at 8 o'clock in the morning. But just not sleeping is kicking my butt. So it's nothing I could do. Like, I try everything. Everything. People ask me questions like, what's on your mind? Nothing. Like, I just can't sleep. And even if I do sleep, I'm up. Like, I'll fall asleep and I'll wake up in like eight minutes. So... It sucks, I'm not even up doing something. And then I'm tired. <laughs> it's crazy. It's mm -hmm. not like I'm not tired, I'm tired. Mm -hmm. I mean, my problem is I can function completely fine I don't fall asleep. So I don't really like, be like, oh, well, I should go to bed. Because I know I'll be fine regardless. I'm gonna be tired and then 30 minutes later I'm wide awake. So. I was like today, like I was so tired on my way there, but then I just started listening, walking there. Mm. I had my headphones in, and the right song came on. I was lit. Not the right song. <laughs> and you're my boss, babe. Even my boss said it. He was like, "Let me see you." And I looked at him. He was like, "Oh, much better. You must have got some sleep yesterday." And I went with it. I was like, "Yeah." Mm -hmm. You know. I was asleep all day. Y'all, what's crazy? Well, I haven't dropped the video in three days, but what's crazy since then? Yesterday I did all my laundry. Like I just had things to do, but I was scrolling social media, and I heard Chris Brown's diss oh, track. That was wild. To Quavo. Yep. Yeah. Uh-huh. That was mad funny. Now, I don't know if you know this. Because when Chris Brown came out, he was really, really young. But he wanted to be a rapper. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he actually wanted to be a rapper, but he could sing, and I guess they thought it would be better 
if he's saying. Just, you know y'all gonna you know you're gonna get an interruption while you're here. Oh, make sure you're following the entire gang. Make sure you subscribe to everybody in the gang, especially me. If you're watching me, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. Make sure you follow me on TikTok. Yeah, so I heard it. I don't know how many of y'all heard it. I know I can't put it here because it's gonna get me, you know what? Maybe I can put a snippet. What did you think about it? It was funny. It was funny. Well, did you find it like fire? Like he should stop everything he's doing right now and become a rapper? Um, <laughs> that would be terrible. You think so? Yeah, he might. He might have be able to rap. But he don't know nothing about rap. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. yeah. I think like nobody makes that switch, even if they can. It's only of the fact that like. They don't know what what's what to do. You can rap all you want, man. You can be, you can have the craziest bars, but that new song is not gonna. I think that first, I, if I, tell me, tell me down below if I'm wrong. But I think he said a little something, like maybe one line about Quavo, like very small. And then Quavo came back, and he had like a verse, and it was so bad, guys. It was it was really whack. It's not all it. And then he so he dropped this. I think it's called the weakest link. Y'all. He kicked his butt like for real. Like and, I, and everybody's like, <laughs> if Quavo don't got something, he's amigos if you don't know by the way. Listen, if he if he don't um say something, his career is over. But I you know to be honest with the amigos, I like some of their music, you know. It was like you could rock out to some of their music, but I always thought uh, Takeoff, lyrically, was the best. Then I came Offset. I personally like Offset new album. And Quavo, I never liked him by himself. I, I think I that's never not did. really... Um, I think that's the whole point. Is Quavo's not really like... Yeah, he can rap or whatever, but... He's also like just the face of them. Mm -hmm. Like, he's always uh, uh, the, in the middle of all the album covers. He's like... You, I feel like you say his name, and that's why you think of the Migos. You don't say, especially take off, rip take off. But he was irrelevant. And yeah, but he can rhyme though. He had he had one, I know, but one of the best lyricists. But nobody knew that because he was so in the back of it all. He was laid back. Some people say that um, Chris Brown took us too far with that line about take off. I feel like if you're gonna be scary about it, then don't start something. Yeah, because that's really what battle rap was about. Because, like, who, who are you, who is, whatever his name is, or either of them to say, like, what the boundaries are. Yeah, back in the day, when two people had beef, they would be rapping, rhyming. You know, that's how it was, like, going, at, saying whatever, talking about whatever they could find on you. But, um, yeah, I felt like that one. I mean, like, I was like, wow, I really was taken back. Like, that Chris Brown dancing like that, singing like that? Mm hmm That was one of the biggest things that broke the internet. I know Drake dropped his little diss track in the fire. I don't know how my man Kanye got in it. <laughs> of course Kanye had to put himself in it. I am a god. Everybody says, who does he think he is? I just told you who I thought I was. A god. But he dropped he dropped one for Drake and helping out I don't know whoever Drake was against. But I don't know how nobody bothered Kanye. Nobody said nothing about Kanye. Kanye always thought I'm stupid. Yeah, if y'all new here, you know, if you don't you probably don't know I'm a huge Kanye West fan. I love all his music. It is what it is. I know he's a little hoo hoo about all of his music and I'm starting to miss the old Kanye. You tried okay, it? I don't know. I kind of like that he's a little guy. Really? Funny. Yeah. It might not be like better music, like, oh, when you listen to that for the rest of your life, but it's like, I like, it's cool. I feel like you gotta be a fan of his to even get his music nowadays. You know what I mean? Like no, I think it's the other way around. Really? Because I, I like a lot of his music. Right now, like this album, I could listen to like, a good five, six tracks on it, but not like the whole album like I used to be able to. 
I was saying like like you don't have to be a Kanye West sucker fan to acknowledge that the song is good. Oh, you, yeah. you you like your your do young people like Kanye West? Yeah, because he's stupid. Because <laughs> he's stupid. <laughs> He's an idiot. So y'all just like stupid people? No, but it's like he's making music now that doesn't, it's not meant to be globally impactful. It's, it's meant to have fun. a good time or some thought into it. Yeah, you don't have to sit back and be like, wow, this was so incredible. <laughs> Y'all, that was so good for me. Yeah, broccoli. All right, so y'all will be. I'm gonna drop this today. I'm gonna drop another video tomorrow. This is a laid back video, y'all. We just chilling, coming, eating today. It's not like too much hot energy. I got a lot to do because I will be leaving in two days. And you know, I'm gonna take y'all along with me. And yeah, I got some stuff coming up and we're gonna have some fun. Now, what you gonna be doing when I'm going? Work. Mm. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh, my schedule is changing again. Again? Cause he smoked one of my men. He got smoked. <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. It's funny. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> It's not funny. We miss you, man. I don't know about we, but I do. <laughs> That's why it's so funny, because if not one person cares but me. Oh, damn. Everybody be like, yeah, Goofy's out of here. Okay. I always tell people that, because sometimes people say like, oh, you Goofy. Like, let's say when they talking, and I know it's in other states, they say it's supposed to be like funny. But over here, that's an insult. You just walk around calling people goofy from New York, like you know what I'm saying? That's like you really insulting me. Like I don't know. I know it's, it's so different other places. They be like, oh, he's goofy, he's a goofy, but it's it's so light for them. Mm -hmm. And here, that's like, what you, who you talking to? Like that? I have to realize, like, it's everybody don't say it the same. Mm. Yesterday, I overheard my boss talking about it, right. The fire. So funny, yeah. And he was like, oh, me, me, me being gone. He was like, yeah, sadly, you know, like, even though his position was high, uh, he was more of just a body in the restaurant. Damn. I was like, so having Goofy going ain't, ain't that big a deal. That's not I was real. like, yo. <laughs> I really hated him. For good reason, though. He sucked. Boom. We oh. demolished our food, y'all. Sean got Goofy's working. I got smoked. Um, I'm going to be traveling. Smoked. And we ate like it's nobody's business. And he's gonna go lay down as soon as this is done. Yeah. Anyway, I love, love, love y'all. And until we have Chinese food, until we come on just to kick it with you guys, until I have Shawnee back on again, which will probably be sometime next week, because I'm thinking about doing something to him. I haven't pranked you in a long time. Week. You said week? We'll think of something. Until we do all these things again, I'll see you guys soon. Later. Sleepyhead. Y'all gotta go. We gotta leave. Sean's tired.